All right, hey, what's going on? This is Dan Keller, your mortgage advisor at Guild Mortgage. I wanna welcome you to another episode of Making Sense of the Markets. Today is Friday, November 24th, episode number 48. So 48 weeks in a row, I've come to you with a market update and some valuable information that you can use or that you can share. And today I'm coming to you with probably my most impactful message of the year. So it was about four years ago that I learned from one of my mentors and coaches at the time, Bill Hart. Um, I learned the value of having a life plan, the value of really understanding the importance of goal setting and life planning. And so what I do every single November is I take some time to reflect on the past year and plan the next year. And I break it down into two segments. I plan uh, for something that I need to change in my life and my business, and I do that in six months. And then, so I have a six month check-in and then obviously I have my annual business plan. So what I'm gonna share with you today, and there's three levels of it too. So I have my six month, my one year, and then my five year vision that's always on my board in my office above my computer screen so I can see why I work every single day and how hard I work and what I'm working toward. But I want to make a disclaimer. This is something that I learned from Coach Bill Hart that is important for you to understand. You don't need to just do this if you're an entrepreneur or if you're self-employed. This is super important if you are a husband or if you're a wife or if you have kids, if you're single. Um, this is essentially a roadmap or a blueprint to get to where you want to go in life. And so I truly believe that we're not put here to just kind of go through the motions and punch a clock and to go to work every day, come home, hang out for an hour or two, sleep, and then do that again. I really believe that we're put here for a purpose and we're only here for, so, for, for a limited amount of time. So my, my uh, idea on life is let's get the most out of it. So what I wanna do is I wanna share with you how I get the most out of every single day, every single week, month, and year, and then have something that I'm going, that I'm shooting for over the next three to five years. So I always start with this. Every single November, I start with this form right here, where are you now? <clears throat> so I identify seven areas in my life, my work, my money, my love life, my family, my spirituality, my friends, and myself. I identify two things that I need to improve upon, and then I set a deadline toward, for achieving those. So the very next form, just like the one that I just showed you, is where I will be. Now this form specifically identifies where I will be and I put a date on it, so six months from now, at the end of June 2018. And I put a couple of things and I rank. So for example, if it's business and I want to make more money, I, have to, I can't just say I need to make more money. How, I'm go, how am I going to make more money? Well, I need to serve my, my clients better. I need to serve my referral partners better. I need to hire an employee, things like that. That's what you put in there. And then what I do is I identify what I need to do who can help me achieve those goals, and then I set a time for achievement, which would be end of June 2018. The next thing that I do after that, so I identify a few areas in my life that I need, need improved upon and how to get there. The next thing that I, that I do every year is I reevaluate this. So Monday morning, I have a meeting with my financial planner, so I reevaluate this, how much money I need to retire. I work backwards from that based off of my lifestyle goals, and how much money I'm gonna to need to live and then how long it's going to take me based on the money that I'm saving right now and earning right now. The other thing that I'll do is um, I will put together a form that really identifies, it's called my personal family budget. It helps me identify how much money I'm bringing in every month and how much money is going out. If you are not doing this with yourself, with your spouse, with your family, you need to do this. So you can download a copy of this form, the personal family budget at budgetwithdan.com. And then the last thing that I do, and this is I think super important, is I complete a vision traction organizer. This tells me specifically in business, it reiterates what my vision is, what my mission is, why I'm here. Um, you hear a lot of people talking about, and there's books written about it, um, find your why. Why are we here and why do we do what we do? So this reiterates this, sometimes it changes, but it also keeps me accountable to my six month plan, my one year vision, my two year vision, and my five year vision. If you would like more information on this information, just reach out to me. Um, I appreciate you as a past client, as a friend. If you're watching this on social media, thank you for watching this. 
And my job, my goal is to provide as much value to anyone who is following me as I can. Um, you can reach out to me and I can get you copies of these forms. If you have any questions, let me know. And again, thank you for watching and I look forward to coming back to you next week. Bye for now.